What's up, guys? You're welcome to Malcolm TV, where we publish news and politics, entertainment, celebrities, and metro stories. We have another trending news for you today, and the headline reads Breaking Amici in tears as AAC deputy Guba candidate defect to PDP reveals why. Before I go back to reading today's news to you, please, if this is the first time you are watching any of our videos in our channel, please, you can go ahead. Subscribe to our channel by sub hitting that red subscribe button below this video. Then clicking on the red subscribe button. Click on the bell icon beside it so that you will always be updated whenever we publish news like this without missing any news again. Alright, in what is probably turning to become an interesting turn of event, the deputy governorship candidate of the African Action Alliance, Akpoz Ye, which was the party adopted by Transportation Minister Rotimi Amechi pre-gubernatorial election in River State has announced his defection to the People's Democratic Party. Remember that Rotimi Amechi and by extension all Progressive Congress had adopted the AAC as its prevent candidate given the party inability given the, the party's inability to secure its candidate inclusion in the election. This is coming days shortly after rumors filtered out that some heavyweights in PDP were making moves to Leo year with huge sum of cash and gifts. Although the allegation had been denied, the deputy governorship candidate maintained his decision to leave the party. In a letter he addressed to his governorship candidate Biokomabu Awara, Akbo's year, Biokomabu Awara explained that his resignation from his party was informed by alleged hijack or party structure by the All Progressive Congress in the state. While advising the governorship candidate of AAC Awara to liberate himself from Amici's stronghold, he accused Minister of Transportation of pursuing selfish political agenda. In the letter obtained by Daily Post, he said, I write to most respectfully notify of you of my resignation from membership of the African Action Alliance AAC with effect from today. 25th of March 2019 and subsequently defect to the People's Democratic Party PDP. Please note that by this notice I cease to be the deputy governorship candidate of our party, the AAC, for the 2019 governorship election in River State. My decision were informed by the complete hijack of the structure and administration of our party by a faction of the APC in River State led by the Minister of Transportation, Chibike Rotimi Amechi, for his personal political ambition. Furthermore, Rotimi Amechi led faction by the APC is not letting in its determination to subvert the will of reverse people and cause crisis in the state using the platform of our promising party. In this circumstance, I cannot in all conscience continue to lend support to the selfish political venture of the Minister of Transportation which does not mean well for the progress and development of the people of River State. In a budding promising politician, I appeal, I appeal to you to accept the reality of your crushing defeat and liberate yourself from being used by Rotimi Amici to cause unnecessary political crisis in our dear state. Thank you very much and please accept the assurance of my highest regard as always. All right, so this is a letter. Uh, uh, Akpoz Yi actually wrote to uh, the uh, governorship candidate, and that is um, Biopomabo, that he is defecting to PDP. Uh, but before this is defection, there was actually a rumor that he has been lured by PDP heavyweight with heavy cash and gifts, um, which he has com come out to actually debunk that is not actually true. And in his letter, he has accused a major of actually hijacking the party structure and using the party to cause problem and crisis in River State. And I think those were the uh, reason he actually outlined for leaving their own party, that is the AAC. And of course, you guys all know that uh, sequel to the election, the Supreme Court had actually barred APC from feuding any candidates since they could not meet the deadline stipulated by INEC that within three months to the deadline to the election, you must field your candidate. And you all know that APC in River State had two factions. And because of this, they couldn't field any candidate. They couldn't come together to field a candidate. And that actually led to uh, INEC delisting them and subsequently Supreme Court barring them. So Amitya had to adopt AAC 
and AAC was used. And in run up to the election, we all saw that at a point, at the early lead, AAC was actually leading. And at a point in time, Wiki began leading. And as Wiki was leading, nearing the conclusion of the election, military men in uniform, or should I say the Nigerian army actually interrupted the entire coalition proceeding by disrupting the coalition proceeding. So their interruption actually led to uh, the whole election being canceled in River State. So now, today, being 25th of March, the AAC candidate has come to a PDP, and this is a big blow to AAC and APC indirectly. So what do you guys think about this? The guy have actually said that AAC will be defeated, that um, his own colleague, that is the governor, the governorship candidate, the governor, the governorship candidate should not be used by Mechi to cause problem in the state, and that he should not be used to foment more problem in River State. So this guy decamping, do you think that he was lured by cash? What do you guys think? I want you to go ahead, react to it, drop your comment below. Let me know what's in your mind. I know we can brainstorm together. No insult. I don't belong to any party. I'm not PDP. I'm not APC. Go ahead. I'm just neutral. So you can go ahead, reply to this, drop your comment below, react to this video, and let me know what's in your mind. Thank you, guys. God bless you all.